The yield maps, I've been accumulating uh, most of my yield data since 1997. Um, it's just given me a multiple layers to look at and different weather patterns to look at. Um, I, I run the SMS uh, advanced software, so it gives me the ability to take all that information and uh, put it into multi-year multi analysis and uh, run some normalization so that we can do a better job of creating sampling zones or yield zones. And uh, that is basically using that information and soil type data, georeference data. Uh, we've started a whole new soil sampling regime and liming applications and, and variable rate fertilizer applications. It's very user friendly. It's, uh, um you can figure things out how to do how to do stuff and and putting equations in even writing your own equations or tweaking other equations that you have is very user friendly the uh, the way that the tree is organized is very easy to find stuff and the filters and everything if you want to go back and say look at the spraying you did in 2008 it's really easy to filter the tree out or you can know, you can filter it by farm and uh, i think the user friendliness of it is just extremely uh, important plus you still have all the functionality of, of doing different things that, that you want to do and, and you have the ability to easily change things like when importing soil maps you can change the the, the uh, creaking and stuff like that to, for different soil